everyone. This is Tyva, and I'd like to take a moment to thank you guys for subscribing and liking and commenting because those likes and comments help me figure out which direction I want to go when I do my next tutorial. And this tutorial, um, I actually want to do a layering with registration marks tutorial today. So pay close attention. We're actually going to use a Taco Bell logo. And I've already saved us some time by actually go ahead and separating this logo. If you need help with how to actually separate your layering, I actually have a video that'll show you how to do that. So, here is the example of what we're going to be doing. And I always put an example on my DS um, screen so that I can kind of match up the colors. Not perfectly, because it depends on what kind of vinyl that we're going to use. So it doesn't have to match up perfectly. You can go to arrange in order to arrange it to the front back. So that's actually right there on top with some of the white showing. Okay. And when I edit this, I didn't save it as a cut. It saved as a print, so I can go here and actually change it. I'm going to bring that to the front. Okay, and that's going to be white. And this actually comes to the front. Okay, so I have my layers how I want it. I'm going to delete this guide now. So now we're going to do our registration marks. We're going to do stars. And they don't have to be, put that back, that big. Just put them here. So now we count in our layers. We have a blue layer, which is one. This pink layer, two. White layer, three. And the yellow layer, four. So we need a total of four stars. So we click on that, and we're going to duplicate it two, three, four, four times. Move these registration marks. These are your registration marks. And all a registration marks is is when you cut your design, you will have a total of four different layers. You want to layer those registration marks on top of each other so that it will layer exactly like you have it on your DS. So... What we're going to do now, we're going to hide the other layers and work with the bottom layer first, okay, which is blue. So I put this star right here, and this is where I'm going to put all the other stars. So I'm going to click on this. Be very careful not to move your um, design because if you move your design, then it's not going to layer up with the other ones. So I'm going to select all and click weld. And I'm going to move the new star on top of that one and make sure it matches up and then I'm going to hide that bottom layer okay we still have to connect all of these stars we're going to do the Taco Bell white next so we're going to highlight those two weld them together with the other registration mark and put on top like so okay and then we're going to hide the white Oops, I hide my star. Shucks, where did my white go? There we go. We're going to hide that. Move this out of the way. Okay. Now we're going to do the pink bell. And we're going to weld that together. And I'm going to go, oh, we're not going to hide it yet. Because we still have our one more registration mark. Lay that on top, Try this, and then we're going to put the Taco Bell yellow. That is our last one. Select, weld it all together. Now we can actually make all of these visible again. So now you see the red, the yellow star because that was the last star, but remember it's all four stars up under here. And it kind of give you a visual of how it's going to look. You see star there. 
start with here star so here are all your registration marks when you go to make it it's going to show you a total of four different let's see if i can scoot down there we go four different mats each color for each layer and so once you do that these registration marks you're laying them on top of each other but make sure that you lay your bottommost layer down first let's cancel out of here your bottommost layer will be your blue layer your second layer will be the bell which is the pink bell and you just lay that on top of your registration mark and then these two you can go in pretty much any order with these because they're both going on top but this can be your third and this can be your four arrange that to the front okay and that can be your fourth and that is how you do registration marks for your projects i hope that this video tutorial was actually helpful to you guys i hope that it was easy to follow if you have any questions or comments please um comment under this um under this box and i wish you guys the best of luck with using this registration mark technique have a great day